that looks like a great place to recharge your batteries during the dark days of winter. But I'll bet there's even more to see and discover. That's why we got a real insider to pass on a few personal tips. Rolf Haug is a shepherd who lives on the island of Rügen. He's going to show us where he likes to go when he takes a break from tending his flock. Rolf Haug loves his island, especially when it's cold. The shepherd and organic farmer enjoys being out in the wind and weather. At the Hofgut Bisdamitz, a farm in the northern reaches of Rügen, Rolf is responsible for the sheep. And he's also responsible for the house specialty, Bisdamitz cheese. It's popular with gourmets far beyond the shores of this island in the Baltic. And there are plenty of other things that make Rolf proud of his home. I'd like to take you to three places on the island that I find especially interesting and appealing. Because he believes fishermen, like shepherds, are a breed apart, Rolf first heads for the coastal town of Zasnitz. The harbor here is home to one of the last true fishing harbors on Rügen. The special thing about the harbor is that it's a real fishing port. I especially like the fish market hall. At Rolf's first recommendation, the fish market in Zasnitz, you can enjoy fish that was caught just a few hours earlier. There you can sit and watch the fishing vessels come in to moor. Just a few kilometers away from the fishing port in Zasnitz, you'll find the Kurhaus Spa Hotel in the town of Bintz. Rolf's second recommendation. The building was constructed over a century ago. I think the spa hotel in Bintz embodies what I've always imagined a Baltic coast vacation should be. Prominently situated next to the town's pier, the core house was built at the beginning of the 20th century when Germany was still ruled by Kaisers and soon became popular with the country's wealthy. The beautiful view and stylish architecture still draw visitors today. After reconstruction and extensive modernization, today the Kurhaus once again shines with the glamour of a bygone era. Rolf's third recommendation is a little more understated, more of an insider's tip. The Grundvig House is a cultural gem in Zasnitz. Not fancy, but brimming with character, the Grundvig House is home to the Lichtspiele Zasnitz the island's own independently owned cinema. The cultural center also regularly puts on theater performances, concerts, and other events. And those who want to can get creative with the whole family. Here you also have a chance to rub elbows with island locals, which isn't so usual on an island crawling with tourists. So Rolf Haug's recommendations are the culture at the Grundvig House, the Kur House in Binz, and fresh fish in Zasnitz Harbor, one of the last fishing harbors on the island.